Welcome to my channel. Today's video is sponsored by wishbiz.ru. This is like my second time collabing with them and I did choose a purse from their site. I will be unboxing this purse with y'all and giving y'all my honest opinion on it and the quality as well. This is a Jocko Must purse y'all. I did get it in the color black. Also, I did get it small. I'm pretty sure y'all seen this bag before. It's a very, very trendy purse. I decided to get it in black because y'all know black goes with everything. Y'all, the quality on this purse is a 10 out of 10. Not only that, you can make this purse a crossbody instead of a clutch bag. Also, it does come in other colors as well, y'all. They have so many options and choices on their site. As I mentioned, you can make this a crossbody body so i will be showing y'all how it looks as well that way also the quality y'all as y'all can see the detail is literally everything is there it's a nice size purse i feel like you could fit a nice amount of things in here not gonna lie but yes y'all it's definitely cute it's definitely a 10 out of 10 in my book not gonna lie definitely go and check out which biz rule they have so many items on their site y'all you also can use my discount code to get money off your purchase if you're interested in shopping with them let them know that i did send you definitely let them know definitely go and check them out y'all not only that is definitely affordable Welcome to my channel if you are new welcome if you're all welcome i am back for another video and today's video is a vlog slash apartment update tour tour update however y'all want to put it this is not a full furnished apartment update because i do not got my living room together still as y'all can see i'm still working on my living room tv and i'm also working on my fireplace and then i gotta finish my beauty room with the vanity and stuff in there but y'all, I will be doing my bathroom over, redecorating my bathroom, and I will be redecorating my room, moving my bed around for y'all. I bought new covers, new rugs, stuff like that. So I'm basically just gonna get everything together in this vlog, as well as go out to eat. Me and Jakaya and her daughter are finna go to Applebee's. As y'all know, they got like dollar margaritas. So I'm gonna have me probably like six of them. Not gonna lie, cause they're a dollar. So it's like, I'm finna pay damn near $7 for one drink. Why not get seven margaritas? exactly so i'm gonna get dressed do my makeup do my hair get in the shower y'all know freshen up curl my hair up and put on a quick cute outfit i'm thinking about taking promo pictures not gonna lie but i don't know because i've been feeling so weird when i take pictures when somebody else take my pictures who usually don't take my pictures but that's the point like you gotta get out of that so i'm thinking about wearing this black i ain't gonna talk too much i'm gonna give you an outfit update i'm gonna come back to you all once i am most likely together Okay, y'all, so this was my outfit for the day, um, a top that I got from Sheen. I was thinking about putting on some nipple pasties, but it's like, bro, for what? But I got this top from Sheen. I got these jeans from Forever 21. They're like bell bottoms, kind of on the big side, but they fit perfect, not gonna lie. They fit perfect. They go for the look that I exactly wanted. I need to cut my tag off, but y'all, I'm trying to debate if I want to wear this before I get to do my makeup and shit. But I feel like once I do my makeup and my hair, then I'm gonna be feeling it more. So I'm just come back to y'all. I feel like I placed my wig too far back, honestly. It's supposed to be up a little more. But that's what happens when you sleep too wild, okay? Wake up, wig off. Yeah, yeah. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I got holes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my niggas cross the street living large. Thinking back to the fact that they dead. Thought my raps were the facts that they sat with the bars. I got two phones, one need a charge. Yeah, they twins, I can tell they ass apart. I got big packs coming on the way. I got big stacks coming out to save. I got Lil Max with me, he the wave. It's a big gap between us and the game. In the next life, I'm trying to stay paid. When I die, I put my money in the when I die, I put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap till this nigga on my face. Lil CC, let it slap with the base. I used to save hoes with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, love, I'm good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money I done gave. I was on top when that shit meant a lot. Still on top, like I'm scared of the drop. Still on top when these niggas wanna swap. We just wanna swap, make a sauce in the bots. I don't want to change because I'm good where I'm at. Mom ties, so I'm always good where I'm at. Word of Junior, Jazzy, Baby J. Tell them when I die, put my money in the Couple freaking killers, Scarlett Collect. She fucked up.
Fuck a nigga, then she on to the next. Really living large, she ain't all with a Mac. When you niggas think it's small in the mall with a rat. Roll with us if you really wanna get it. Go get a half a million in the sprinter. Phone ringing, bitches know a big tipple. I got the hook up in there, really no limit. Dead broke is in your nigga DNA. Ricky Smile is indicated with his head. Little nigga, just another state case. Very nine motherfucker chase bank, time to bounce. Gotta count on my allowance. You niggas push it, so I gotta rebound it. The nigga tripping like I got a Z and dollars. Got the trap jumping like time when I feet out. Then I'm out. Then I never talk about it. The homie squad, but we all smoke the lobs. Rich niggas in the middle of being modest. Cause the way I do my deals, never treat it like I bought this nigga house. You could DM my account. My DM six figures in them count. Nine figures was the gold till I hit the D. Niggas ain't living so bury mine with me. Off the when I die, put my money in a grave. I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap till this nigga on my face. Let it slap with the bass. I used to save hoes with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, I love them good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money out in cave. I mean, where the fuck should I really even start? I got hoes that I'm keeping in the dark. I got my niggas cross the street living large. Thinking back to the fact that they dead. Thought my raps were the facts that they sat with the bars. I got two phones, one need a charge. Yeah, they twins, I can tell they ass apart. I got big packs coming on the way. I got big stacks coming out to say. So, yo, I did curl my hair and do my makeup. Quick beat. I need to fix my lace. I don't like the way it's looking. Not only that, as I mentioned, I did just put this wig back on. It's supposed to be like right here, right above the burn mark. I'm finna give y'all a quick outfit check. Not gonna lie, my vibe just got killed. Mother Nature did just decide to come. I was gonna change, but I feel like my first day always be like my lightest day. So I'm gonna keep on my outfit that I got on and just take, you know, some girl stuff with me. But that's so much of a vibe killer, honestly. At least it came though. At least it came. I ain't gonna complain. Cute, quick curls. I feel like the wig don't look that bad if you don't actually look at it. But shit, I don't know, y'all. It is what it is. I will be taking this wig off tomorrow because tomorrow is Friday, y'all know. Weekend, the wig. And not only that, I got invited to a lingerie party Saturday. A lingerie party. And they having a pole, like a stripper pole. Everybody got to take turns on the pole. All kind of shit, y'all. So I really don't know if I'm even going at this point. I had an outfit planned. And I really don't want to, we're going to see. We're going to see however I'm feeling when I wake up Saturday morning. I got on this white top from Sheen, Balenciaga purse. These jeans are from February 21. And I got on these cute Balenciaga sandals. Y'all, do not mind my carpet. As I mentioned to y'all, tomorrow I am revamping my room. Like, moving my bed around, shit like that. Changing my covers, new rug, you know. Basically just getting it all the way back together. But Ja'Kaya is on her way. She just texted me, asked me what's already. I'm finna smoke me a blunt. Well, I already grabbed me up a blunt, but I'm finna smoke it. And then, yeah, head out the door. I was gonna do pink, like pink shoes, pink bag. But at this point, I'm just ready to fucking go. The sun trying to sun a little bit. Got a little Max with me, he the waves. It's a big gap between us and the game. In the next life, I'm trying to stay paid. When I die, I put my money in the grave. When I die, I put my money in the grave. I really got to put a couple niggas in a place. Really just slap every nigga in a race. I really might tap till this nigga on my face. Well, CC, let it slap with the bass. I used to save hoes with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, I love them good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money out in cave. I was on top when that shit meant a lot. Still on top, like I'm scared of the drop. Still on top, when these niggas wanna swap. Niggas wanna swap, make a sauce in the box. I don't wanna change, cause I'm good where I'm at. Mom ties, so I'm always good where I'm at. Word of Junior, Jazzy, Baby J. Tell them when I die, put my money in a Couple freaks kill a skull, we collect. She fuck a nigga, then she on to the next. Really living large, she ain't all with a Mac. When you niggas think it's small, in the mall with a rat. Roll with us if you really want to get it. Go get a half a million in the sprinter. Phone ringing, bitches know a big tipple. I 
got the hook up in the really no limit. Dead broke is in you nigga DNA. Ricky Smile is indicated with the shade. Little nigga just another state case. Very now motherfucker chase bang, time to bounce. Gotta count on my allowance. You niggas push it so I gotta rebound it. So y'all, we at Epley's. Finna leave, just went on our change. So that we can leave. My meal, my total was $12 for my burger, fries, and my three drinks. They end up telling us that it was a, a three price and drink limit. Last minute, supposedly, when I really wanted like five. But we finna just go to the liquor store. Like, what do you, just like a nigga be like, what do you bring to my table? You ever had a nigga ask you that? You ain't never had a nigga ask you what you bring to the table? No, ma'am. <laughs> But y'all, we got the part taking shots. I'm two shots in. I'm gonna take one more. And then I'm probably gonna stop because it's a little still early. It's only like six o'clock, <laughs> six thirty. <laughs> I wanna you know what I'm mad about low key? You weren't able to say. So y'all, the last time y'all seen me was on Thursday afternoon. We was at the park letting her daughter play while you know taking shots really just chilling vibing out talking um i did end up going out by myself that like i should have recorded i had her drop me off at the little bar that we'd be going to and they'd be doing free shots taji and some other friends end up being up there i end up getting drunk with them staying outside with them till like four in the morning a time was definitely had and i didn't spend no money y'all know i love me a good free night but today is currently saturday it is the night of the girls night that i've been telling y'all about I'm lucky to bend if I want to go due to Mother Nature being here. But I'm going to go for the simple fact I told her that I was going to come. You get what I'm saying? She been planning this out last month. So it's like, okay, just put your shit on. Go. Enjoy yourself. Leave whenever you're ready to leave. As long as you know that you went and showed her support and participated. Not only that, she ended up getting like custom stuff made and like um, sipping paints. You know, starting stuff with certain people. So I'm going to definitely go, you know, vibe out. I don't need to re up on some weed. I'm trying to debate if I want to re up now or just wait until I leave out. But it's giving re up now because it's already one o'clock. It started at nine o'clock. My hair is not done. Really nothing. So I really got to get myself together. I'm going to start getting dressed around seven. So that gave me time to really lolly yak and get shit ready around the house. So I figured in between time, in the meantime, use my time wisely and clean up. My house look a mess. Real raw and cooked. Stove, kitchen sink, counter. Kitchen table don't look that bad, but it could be fixed up. Garbage need to go out. I threw up in that fucking garbage so bad. Then this is how my living room look. My packages for the stuff that I'm supposed to be redoing, like my bathroom and stuff is there. My cover back there because I ended up trying to fit it in the washing machine downstairs and it would not fucking fit. So I had to go take it to laundry man and wash it and I still haven't done that yet. My table, a mess. So yeah, I'm going to just basically get my shit together. I'm going to show you my bathroom and my room as well so that y'all can understand what I'm cleaning up, what I'm getting together. This is what my dresser looks like. <laughs> Real raw uncut. My bed. I literally just got out the bed. Dirty clothes that need to be washed. I need to vacuum my floors. Then this is what my bathroom looks like. A mess. Counter looks a mess. Bathroom looks a mess. So yeah, I'm just gonna basically put y'all in fast motion, do my dishes, clean up my kitchen, redo my room. I'm really trying to bet if I'm gonna redo my room in this video because I really want my bed moved and I cannot move my bed and I'm here by myself. So, I don't know. We gonna see. Rich niggas in the middle being modest Cause the way I do my deals Never treat it like I bought this new house You could DM my account My DM six figures and I'm counting Nine figures was the gold Till I hit the E Niggas ain't living so bury my with me off the When I die I put my money in a grave I really gotta put a couple niggas in a place Really just slap every nigga in a race I really might tap till this nigga on my face Let it slap with the face I used to say Pose with a mask in a cave. Now I'm like, nah, love on good, go away. Ain't about to die with no money, I done gave it.
Okay, y'all, so it's currently two o'clock. I did my dishes, cleaned off my stuff, cleaned off my table, swept my floors, took out my garbage. I literally did everything a lot more put together because <laughs> that shit was a mess. The bleach is messing with my allergies. So before I start vacuuming, I'm about to air my house out because y'all know it's allergy season. The weather is changing and that's the worst for us. They got allergies. I did buy a new front rug for right there. As y'all can see, I got that white rug. Yes, it was white, sis. It's damn near gray. Like, it's so dirty. So, I ended up buying a new one. I'm about to put that down and then get my bathroom stuff together while I'm waiting for the house to air out. Then I'm vacuum and then start in my bathroom.
mine, it's a movie. Blue cheese, I swear I'm addicted to blue cheese. I gotta stick to this paper like blue sleep. Bitch, I'm about my chicken like it's a two-piece. You can have your bitch back, she a groupie. She just swallow all my kids in a two-seat. Swagged out, familiar, we bringing them gas out. I still got some racks stuffed in the trap house. Off the 42, I'm blowing her back out. I'm back out. Bullshit, spin back with a full clip. They say I'm with a full clip. And my shooters, they shooting. I'm gonna take it like two clips. And it's adios. If I'm with the trees, then she give it though. Yeah. When I see police, then we get low. That's when another piece, that's another zone. Ice in the VV, now she down to get cheesy. I got all this water on me like Fiji. Bitch, I'm posted up with hats and the sleazies. Yeah. Yeah. Slip in the Zaza, it goes straight to the Mata. Then I'm up in the chopper, hitting the cha cha. Open his slot, then he dance in my cha cha. Slip in the Zaza, it goes straight to the Mata. Then I'm up in the chopper, hitting the cha cha. Then I'm hitting his slot, then he dance in my cha cha. Okay, y'all, so this is how my room look. I did end up buying black silk sheets, a black comforter, and this colored rug instead of the usual pink that I usually do. I am about to get some black curtains, y'all. And those two pink pillows will not be there. I'm about to get some silver pillows. So hopefully it will come together, look a little more aesthetically. I really didn't want to show y'all until I was really finished with it. I also got some pictures from my wall in the way. This is really not an updated room tour. It's basically just me cleaning my room, honestly, truthfully. I am about to clean my bathroom now start on this throw all this stuff away and just yeah okay y'all so this is how my bathroom turned out i got these black things from sheen which was like 11 dollars for three that is a little bit too big but we just got it there for the moment shower cone was three dollars this success thing was like four or five dollars this was like three dollars that black thing this soap dish and those was probably like um I think this is like probably four dollars. It also came with another one that I'm using as an ashtray. Every time they give me one, like an extra one, instead of using it for like a mouthwash thing, I do use it for an ashtray instead because I know that I'll be in my bathroom smoking. But yeah, y'all, just how everything turned out, real cute and simple. I got my soap up there, soap dish, two pays, mouthwash, cute little aesthetic stuff, my face wash stuff, two brush soap, stuff like that. So yeah, that's. The look for the bathroom y'all and i want to do more to it like this right here i do not want this right here as i mentioned to y'all in my last video i am ready to get rid of this so i will be ordering a wall basically like a wall cabinet that i could put up or have like one of my brothers or somebody put up and just leave it like that because i'm so over this roller thing not only that it's like it's taking up space and my bathroom not even big so it's really like i need this to be moved y'all it's currently four o'clock whole house clean everything put up that needs to be put up I don't know if I want to smoke, if I want to take me a nap, if I want to wash my hair and start getting ready. Because as I mentioned, I want to start getting ready around 7 o'clock. I don't want to be the first person there. And I like that. I want to go to the liquor store and stuff like that. So, start my hair or most likely smoke, watch a TV show, and then start on my hair. We're going to figure it out. But, but y'all, as I mentioned earlier in this vlog, I did want to fix my bathroom with y'all in my room. And basically, I just straighten up and clean up. So, yeah. That's that. I really dimmer in this vlog. I know I said I was going to vlog the girls' night, but she ended up moving it. She's not having it at her house. She's having it at somebody else's house. So I really don't want to, like, I don't know, y'all. I don't know. If you get what I'm saying, you get it. I really don't know how to explain it. But I don't want to be uncomfortable. Neither do I want anybody else uncomfortable. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm vlogging, recording, and we finna have a lingerie. So respect. Not only that, I want everybody to be comfortable. You know what I'm saying? It's not my event. It's not my thing that I'm having. I will show y'all my outfit, how I'm looking before I leave, and then close out this vlog. So y'all, this is hours later. I put my wig on, kind of, sort of. Didn't really do too much to it because the fucking girls' night ended up getting canceled. It ended up getting canceled, pushed back to a different time. So me and Jakai are like, okay, fuck it. We just gonna get a bottle and then go to a little bar or something. I go in my purse to look for my lip gloss while I'm doing my makeup, and I can't find my wallet. My whole fucking wallet is gone. trying to be a fucking crybaby y'all i'm really not trying to be a crybaby but i do not want to pay for a new driver's license i just got food stamps yesterday the fuck my whole quest card and my temporary quest card is in my wallet my, my cash app card is in my wallet my youtube debit card is in my wallet everything is in my fucking wallet like i'm just so irritated and annoyed last week i just lost my keys just found them got them back now this year, like I can't win for losing. I'm really ready to have a drink at this point. Maybe I need to stop drinking, but at this point, I'm really ready to have probably five drinks. And I'm glad I figured it out now while I'm at home instead of me getting all the way to a club or a bar or somewhere. But it's still the principle, G, like, no. <sighs> Quick prayer.
Then not only that, the girl who I was with, who I was driving in the car with, she just pulled over and pimped out her whole car looking for my shit. My shit not in there. So it's giving, it got to be at the club. It's at where I was at that night. Or somebody took it. Somebody picked it up and took it with them. Literally, like, what the fuck, G? I can't win for losing, y'all. So, y'all know I look crazy as hell. It's currently, like, the next week from when y'all last seen me. Y'all seen me Saturday night. It's currently Tuesday afternoon. I'm about to get up do my hair, get myself together, and record some content videos. So I will be closing out this vlog and starting a new vlog tomorrow, basically like ending out my weekend, weekly vlog. As I mentioned, the girls' night did end up getting canceled. She ended up trying to push it back, but everybody else got to work, you know, got different stuff going on, got their kids. So I don't think that's ever going to happen again. So I'm thinking this weekend to have me a game night, you know, instead of just doing all girls, you know, boys and girls type of shit, just a little cool game night. Everybody come, bring some liquor, bring some weed, you know, vibe out, chill, listen to music, y'all know, talk, conversations, play games. But y'all, I did end up finding my ID, well, my wallet. Um, one of my neighbors ended up having it. He ended up saying that he seen it in the hallway and he picked it up. He said he looked at the ID picture and he was like, he know my face. So he just go in till he see me and he ended up giving it to me. But me personally, I don't trust shit. I don't trust nobody. So I am about to order all new debit cards because, you know, you probably could have took a picture of my shit, anything. You probably tried to use my shit and it didn't go through. So you probably trying to think, okay, let me wait. Think she going to unlock her cards. Anything of that sort. Or probably not. I could be wrong. But for just me being on the safe side and knowing that I got bills to pay, I'm in the middle of trying to buy a car. I am about to order new debit cards because I don't have no time for no fraud, no, none of that. None of that definitely excited about that happy that i did get my license back in my quest car and stuff like that because i did need food throughout the month and shit like that but yes y'all that's that god is good god is good i am about to end up this vlog here don't forget to like comment and subscribe don't forget to go follow me on instagram and on tiktok it will be in the description box below also my other channels will be in the description box below as well y'all we have 54k we're gonna run to 100k y'all know the vibes and until next time i will see y'all in my next video